EVOD has wasted billions of dollars and has caused heartache for millions of Californians. State lawmakers want to see major changes in the agency handling unemployment claims in California. EDD's recently appointed director testifying at a hearing on the department in the assembly Tuesday, acknowledging the workload ahead to improve. I remain as fierce and dedicated to serving the well-being of the people we serve as I have ever been. The agency is juggling a backlog of nearly one million claims coupled with an attempt to tackle fraudulent activity plaguing the department. The amount collected from the EDD in fraudulent claims has now climbed to $27 billion. But state legislative analysts and officials with Bank of America told lawmakers the fraud is not unique to California, noting the problem stems from the federal pandemic unemployment assistance program. And fraud is challenging unemployment programs everywhere across the country. The size and scale of the California program attracted substantial fraud. Before Tuesday's hearing, the state auditor released findings of a months-long investigation into the department, finding a series of inefficiencies and missteps that have led to an overwhelming workload for the EDD. The report warned because of eligibility rule changes, some Californians who received unemployment benefits may have to pay money back. A clawback at a time when they can barely make any ends meet. And it's the very EDD that is creating this havoc in their lives. The EDD should have been part of the solution. And now, for two and a half million Californians, it's likely they will continue to be the problem. The auditor later this week is expected to release another investigation into EDD fraud prevention. In Sacramento, Ashley Zavala, 17 News.